Hey everybody, we're back with another Looking At Toys video and in today's video we're going to be looking at these three sets which feature Nightwing vs Killer Croc, Batman vs Clayface and Batman vs Solomon Grundy. These figure sets all date back to 2014 and when combined together do make one super size set. Uh, with us being collectors, of course, we're sadly not going to be putting the three together, um, but we are showing you these all individually, and uh, we'll have a closer look at each of these sets then. And this is the first set that we're going to be having a look at, and this is the Nightwing versus Killer Croc set. And we have got a special guest with us who's going to talk us a little bit more about what we've got inside. It's me. Are those the blue ones in the background? Yes. And as you can see, we've got the menacing killer croc. Highly detailed. That looks really realistic to the game. They have gone into a lot of detail with these figures to capture all of the detail. These are highly articulated and highly detailed figures. And of course, they are toys, but they are intended for the adult collector. And let's flick over the box and uh, let's see what we've got on the other side. As you can see, it gives you information on the character pile. So as you can see, it tells you about Nightwing and Killer Croc. And of course, the set, when opened up, does make this uh, feature here. And when all three of the sets are put together, they will make a prison cell, which of course holds the uh, one prisoner inside there. And the side of the box again has the image here of the killer croc. And then we've got Nightwing on the other side. And this is the second one in the series, Batman vs Clayface. This is the only one we weren't able to get from the UK. And uh, I think in the end we got this from America. May have been somewhere like California that this came from. I'm not 100% sure, but uh, we've got again, Batman going to talk us through what we've got inside. So, you've got a 1970s Batman. How can people tell this is a 1970s Batman? Looks a bit like me with his chest there. And then we have Clayface. A rather horrifying looking character. Uh, Doll Dead managed to capture the detail very well. And as you can see, he's got two interchangeable hands. He's got a fist hammer. At the back you can barely see. Oh yeah, right at the back there. So there is some interchangeable parts there. And it does show here where we can make the uh, the fist swap over to make a hammer. Sort of reminds me a little bit of Sandman. And then this is the third one in this set. Uh, this one was available from the UK, um, but was quite a hard one to find. For every 10 of the first set, uh, which features the Killer Croc, there's probably only one of these available. So every 10 and one of these, so one per case of the other. And um, let's have a close look and see what we've got inside. So we've got Batman from the Earth One comics. So this is a comic book variant. Design. And um, it 
It's quite realistic. Now on the back we have again information on both characters. So the back one to the left and then this one on the right here for Solomon Grundy. And again it includes the base and the side of the prison in the set here. And if we do take a closer look at the picture, we can see what I mean. The uh, top here, the ears are quite short, whereas on the figure, they've actually made them quite tall. So here we have it then, folks. The three figure sets in this series, all made by Matty Collector, which is a division of Mattel for DC Comics. And looking at toys, we do feature rare and collectible toys. So do be sure to subscribe to our channel if you do like looking at toys. Any comments are always welcome down below. You are of course welcome to share this video and if you have enjoyed watching this video then do be sure to hit the like button.